How about them dogs? It's the battle cry of the red and black. Fans of the University of Georgia bark proudly when their athletic teams take to the field. Although the nickname surfaced a little more than a hundred years ago, Georgia wasn't always known as the Bulldogs. Let's look at what led the University of Georgia to the doghouse. When Georgia's first football team took to the field in 1892, there was a goat on the sideline. A couple of years later, a female bull terrier that was the mascot of the Chi Phi fraternity began making appearances at games. Adding to that was the school's first president, Abraham Baldwin, who was a Yale Bulldog. Early buildings on campus were designed following the blueprints of buildings at Yale. Some thought Georgia should adopt Yale's mascot as a tribute to Baldwin. According to UGA Sports Information Department, it was around 1910 when newspaper writers would occasionally refer to Georgia's teams as Bulldogs. But it wasn't until 1920 when one writer referred to the dignity and ferociousness of the Bulldog that the name stuck. Ugga the Bulldog attends games in an air-conditioned house located near the cheerleaders at Sanford Stadium. There have been 10 Uggas since 1956, all of them owned by the Seiler family of Savannah. Earlier this year, Sports Illustrated named Ugga the best mascot in all of college football.